Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Let's start with the fun with stargazing. We have two levels this time. So um, let's start with the first level and there we start with pizzicato. Pizzicato, we have two types of pizzicato we can play on the flute. We can use the lips and we can use the tongue. Let's start with the lip pizzicato. First, you curl your lips like this. And then you make this sound. And now you use the flute as a soundboard. So don't try to really play the flute. So this is the lip pizzicato, but if you are playing the, the second level, that's too difficult. So luckily we also have the tongue pizzicato. The easiest way to, to show you is put the tip of your tongue to your upper lip like this and try to make uh, the same sound as with the lip pizzicato. It's not entirely the same, but almost. And now again, use the flute as a soundboard. And let the B we find uh, wind sounds. Wind sounds sound like this. So instead of blowing into the flute, we aim the air higher. And you can use your lower lip for that. So I will show you. Let's start with a, a normal note and uh, look at the head joint. And, do, and then move your lower lip forward. If you find it difficult to, uh, to, to get the wind sounds, uh, move your tongue to the front in your mouth. Then it will be easier. And then at letter C we have the tone bending. There are three ways to use tone bending. First, uh, decrease the airspeed. The second way is by moving your head up and down. And the third is by moving your arms. And you can also combine those. Okay, and then in level two, we have another um, technique. It's flutter tongue. And for this vi video, I assume you already can let the R roll. So, in the front of your mouth or in the back, that's, that's fine. So we have try to do it without voice. And if we do, then we get the, the air speed of the air going. And blow to your hand. And now we use vu. And uh, try to change the direction of the air using your lips, so not your head, but only the lips. And now we do And now without voice. Okay, now the tricky part. Um, we place the flute in playing position and again uh, try to do the exercise and ch uh, uh, start changing the direction. And for the, the second level, you have to combine the wind sounds with flutter tongue. So that's a nice effect. Have fun.